Assalamu alaikum. Ramadan Karim. Come on in. Welcome home, Habibi. Wa alaikum assalam. Assalamu alaikum everybody, Ramadan Kareem, and ala alaikum inshallah bisaha wa salama. Actually guys, I've been working on this apartment since Chantal was in Canada, you know. I did my best and I hope you guys like it. Welcome. Alright, so among the upgrades, we added some pictures, some artwork on the wall here. This is a traditional home style from Damascus, Syria region. My husband is Syrian, in case those of you who don't know. We have a new fancy clock. We have another painting with a nice scene, seaside scene. Those of you who were wondering, we do have central air system here. It is very necessary to have air conditioning in Kuwait in the summer. <laughs> we also added some lights for Ramadan, some decorations. It really makes a relaxing ambiance. And this says, Subhanallah, MashaAllah, Tabarakallah, Wallahu Akbar. Here we have this organization area, actually. It's really convenient. We can put our wedding rings here, wallet, keys, change, phone, everything. It comes with a cup holder, really neat. And we have the gaming laptop here. And this is the whole gaming station. With the shisha. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, the Beezer signature scent, rose vanilla. <laughs> Hello, come on back. First, this here, this partition here, this curtain was put up and it's actually really convenient because it allows extra privacy. So if Salah wants to have um, his friends over, his male friends, they can socialize in here and I can do my thing in the kitchen or in the room. Also, if we order things, then we can just go like this <laughs> so I don't have to full hijab. Come on back. So here we have our bathroom shoes together and the bathroom is kind of the same except we have the washer and dryer stacked here we have a separate switch we have to turn on in order to activate the electric the shower does not reach back there however and this is a water filter when you have a smaller space you have to kind of stack things and make do with the space you have so i think salah did an amazing job here we have a whole bunch of water because here in Kuwait you cannot drink the tap water. So we just have a lot of water because pretty much a camel <laughs> and I drink a lot, a lot of water. I drink at least two of these a day. Here Salah had this electric installed. It's to operate the stove and this is for the hot water tank. All right, now for my kitchen guys. So when I was away Salah Got a new cooker, oven, stove, combination. I just put these on here to cover the, the elements. Clean pot, but I keep it on the stove, just somewhere to store it. My spice rack, and I traded the um, candy for some fruit, mangoes and oranges. This is our full-size refrigerator. And here I have a bunch of kitchen items. I just stack them all in here. And so I have utensils, my chopper, my three-in-one, and uh, some popcorn, some grains and pastas and things, and some canned items down here. We have a, an old shisha there. <laughs> and we have the garbage, the garbage bin. This is my sink. And the dishes, these are all clean. And I just have some food items up here, mostly tea, honey, my collagen, and my vitamins for my hair growth. 
a juice jug, a thermos, and some halwa cutting board. And I have this rice cooker. All of this is clean. It's just stocked up here for, you know, <laughs> lack of where to put it. So, but the rice cooker, a serving tray, and this heats up shisha coals. And we have the air fryer, and we have the shisha supplies, the coals, and the flavor tobacco here. And here I have the microwave. All right, and here is the bedroom. We just have some clothes hanging up here. I put my abayas, my prayer gown. This is my new prayer gown, by the way. <laughs> Hijab built in. Also, if you notice, this was in our living room before. We put this in the bedroom and we got a new carpet. This carpet here. And here we have the entertainment center. We have our router and our couple's channel up, of course. Um, please feel free to subscribe and join if you so choose. We plan on doing a lot of positive content and traveling in the future, inshallah. We have a prayer rug here and the abode of my chubby hamster, uh, Howie or Harry. <laughs> he is unfortunately sleeping. I will insert a little clip here of him uh, earlier, if you like, when he was awake. This is our bed here, very comfortable. We have a wardrobe. This is my mirror here where I get ready and have some things hanging from it. My travel items, my purse and CPAP under here. And of course, the Quran, which I have been reading. This is translated and yeah, I'm really enjoying. I at least even try to read one page a day, especially in preparation for my first Ramadan. <laughs> Alhamdulillah. And my makeup here. These magnets and this little plate of pins and things. If you're a hijabi, you will know what I mean. <laughs> and I love here that this bed has this rest. You can put your glasses and earphones or whatever else on there. All right, guys, that's the end of the tour. And for those people who celebrate Ramadan, I wish you uh, good health and peace. This is actually going to be my first Ramadan and I'm super excited to be celebrating it here in the Middle East with my husband. And I'll support you as much as I can, baby. Oh, you're the sweetest. And I want to say about our apartment, I know it's small and we really make good use of the space and we love it. It's very cozy and it's all that we need for the two of us very easy to clean up and I love the upgrades. When I came home from Canada and I was so tired, I came in and all of the hard work that Salah did, I just want to tell you how much I appreciate it because I could tell you did it with love and to make it more comfortable for me here. You deserve it, baby, and you're worth more than this. Oh, you're so sweet, I love you. <laughs> I love you too. All right, guys, so we hope you enjoyed sharing our home with us and until the next video, we'll see you later. We hope you enjoyed, guys. Thank you for watching and goodbye. Ma salam. Ma salam, bye. And Ramadan Karim. Ramadan Karim. <laughs>